Hello and welcome. In this video session, I'm going to show you how to optimize your PDF documents for search engine optimization purposes. Okay, what I do is when I create a PDF file, I start off with Adobe Illustrator. And the first thing that I do once I work out, okay, you know what? I'm going to have this information and that information and this information and so on. Then I think, okay, can I link out on my PDF document? Mm, I can, mm, I cannot. It makes no difference. If I can, then what I do, I open Windows and I choose Attributes option. Then what will happen is it will allow me, Adobe Illustrator will allow me to create image maps on a particular object okay let's say if I select this as you can see I've already went ahead and placed a URL because I know I want to link out from this particular keyword right and let's say that on this particular object um, I want to link out to Google Analytics now that's how I start when I um, want to optimize my PDF documents for SEO purposes right now if I then choose say for web and devices then if I want to preview it in a browser what will happen is although this is an HTML file Adobe Illustrator is saying to me okay you know what this is the information we have as far as it's gonna look like this but see Adobe Illustrator is saying to me okay we have these image maps Okay, so that hmm, that's kind of important for me, right? Now, one thing we must understand: no one is going to tell me or you, as far as Google being aware of this. In my personal opinion, I believe it is because we're dealing with digital here, right? Google deals with digital things online, right? So, if that's the case, you know, this information is attached to that um, PDF document that I'm going to create in a minute, right? Now, whether Google takes that into consideration for ranking purposes and so on, no one's gonna know that, right? In my personal opinion, I believe they do, okay? Because digitally this information is being attached. So, let's cancel that out. Therefore, as you see, this is how I start um, optimizing my PDF. It starts with Adobe Illustrator and if I want to link out then I use the attributes option to provide that information okay therefore then you simply save your file save as a PDF document and Bob's your uncle then next step comes in and the next step is let's say we've got um, Adobe Acrobat open here let's say I open that particular um, PDF document that I've just saved what will happen is it will allow you to highlight you can right click create link or you can go to advanced options um, sorry tools advanced editing and then you can create uh, uh, the same thing as such okay now we don't want to do that what we want to do is we want to we highlight the text we right click it this is what I do okay as you saw you can do so the same thing here but I think it's more intelligent because it allows me to capture exactly what I want okay instead of the, the quotes here I want to simply highlight the text right click create link um, you have many options here you can play around with it I'd like to choose the invisible rectangle okay you can if you're linking out to a file then you surely choose that and then give the URL to the file what I want to do in this particular example I want to um, when someone clicks on that link I want them to go to a new web page right open a web page now here you simply place um, your your own URL okay so this is how you start okay and then you simply let's say you this is how you create the link now so that becomes a hyperlink now if you do not have links going out then no problems what you do next is whether you link out or not you choose the properties option and within it you can place all the information that 
is related which I'm going to show you now I've got the same file that I've already went ahead and placed the links that I want to link out to and then on the properties option here the title you can give it a title and title should be um, very close match to the name of the document that you create it's only logical you can give yourself um, you know author perhaps your URL matters not okay and then subject is subject description is the subject okay we can place keywords now keywords need to be you know we gotta think of keywords hmm okay you know do I put a lot of keywords in there no you don't what you do is you place keywords which is within the document itself okay so that's only logical now you have additional metadata information as you saw here what you see here it comes from all this information um, document title author author title description of the document itself you can place keywords you can place copyright information and so on so that's how you optimize your PDF documents this is a must if you create a PDF document you simply must have this information for better Google rankings okay why is because let's say I've got a PDF document that I'm going to show you that Google has indexed okay it has cached it now when we think of you know whether it's PDF documents we're thinking of whether it's HTML or PhD documents that matters not what we need to think about how Google you know does Google cache the URL okay this is a URL in form of it's a PDF file now Google um, you know indexes so many different file formats okay whether it's doc PDF HTML PHP all this stuff right so when you think of Google rankings you gotta think of this as a URL instead of just a, a file you know a PDF file and so on okay surely it's a file it's a web file but Google caches it meaning it stores the information so that particular PDF document this particular PDF document Google actually stored the information as such once again Google is a text based search engine right when we talk when we talk about um, Google rankings we gotta think of, of text right so if it does put all this text in its database then surely it's only smart for us to create these files right now and as you see it it does store this in its servers right so but let's have a look control U, open the source code and look what it's doing here okay it has stored this information in its database but it has all this information as far as what that file is all about and as you see it has the author okay it has the title of the page uh, of the file uh, subject okay and uh, keywords and so on right and it has all the other information but it also has the links right see it also indexes everything here right this is how it stores everything that's what it's telling us the cache means that so this is what Google sees on that document it doesn't see it doesn't see you know what we see here okay it sees this and then it will surely determine what in the world is that file is all about and therefore you know it's gonna look at everything here not just this it's not just gonna look at this it's gonna look at everything okay and in everything what we do is we provide information for Google as to hmm this is the file and this is what it's all about okay and what it's all about as you see from the PDF you know properties we can place all that information here okay we can place all this information right surely this is a different file that I'm showing you just to give you an example but we have the hyperlinks as well so that's very important too furthermore we have all this other information as well okay so that's how you optimize your PDF documents for search engine optimization purposes
I thank you once again and I encourage you to watch other video sessions that I made available for you and I like to talk to you very soon. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.